Now we're going to see an example of how to set up your own matinee sequence, how to animate your cameras and use matinee to do that, and then we'll set up a quick blueprint that will allow us to fire off all of this cool matinee and animation stuff uh, whenever we hit the play button or basically whenever we run the game. Okay, so I'm in the cave effects demo. I saved the scene under a different name uh, to not affect the original one. And there are some cameras here. So the first thing I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to clean up the scene, remove matinee stuff, remove camera stuff, all that. I'm going to get rid of it. So if I come over here and do a search for camera, you see that we have three camera actors. And there they are selected in the viewport. Okay. So uh, the first thing you'll notice is that when I select one of these cameras, you'll get a little camera preview in the lower right. And that's pretty cool because it's a quick and easy way of us to be able to see through the camera's uh, point of view without having to do any extra work. It's just a preview that pops up right there. Right now I'm going to take all these cameras and I'm going to go ahead and delete them. Now when I do that, uh, Unreal is going to tell me, wait, wait, this stuff is being referenced by another actor. Do you really want to delete it? Uh, and some this what this is, is a fail safe just in case you're accidentally about to break something uh, in this case I really do want to delete this stuff so I'm gonna say yes to all and I have a matinee actor if I want to I can go to matinee and there's one matinee in here which is the one that had all that animation stuff that we saw in the previous video I don't need it anymore so I'm just gonna go ahead and delete that now Unreal again is gonna tell me hey wait this stuff's being referenced by level blueprint do you really want to delete this? I'm going to hit yes. If I go up to blueprints, I can see that I have a couple of sub-levels here. I've got a level here, level blueprint. I could go ahead and open up these uh, different sub-level blueprints. So here's one of them, uh, the cave cine. So this has some stuff going on. It's got some uh, play here. It's got an unknown variable which used to be connected to a matinee actor. I'm going to go ahead and delete all of that stuff. Don't need it. I'm cleaning this all up. Let's go back to blueprints. Let's go to the edit cave map effects. And nothing in here, so this one's good to go. Let's go to, if we open up just the regular level blueprint. We can see it. we don't have much here except an event begin play, which really isn't doing anything right now. Got some other stuff in here. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. Don't really need any of this stuff. I want to just clean this stuff up. Okay, cool. I'm going to save this. All right, so let's play this now. And now we don't get a matinee. We don't get a cinematic or anything. Now we're just in the regular viewport and stuff, and we can just, you know, fly through here and look at this level. Sorry if it's a little bit choppy, I'm recording as I run Unreal 4, so that's always pretty taxing on the computer on the workstation. Okay, so basically I just wanted to verify that the old matinee and all of its animation is gone, which it is. So cool, so now we have a completely blank uh, clean level to create some matinee stuff in. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. And the next one, we're going to go ahead and start creating our cameras and creating our matinee and seeing how all this stuff works.